Jeremy, any advice for rookie YouTubers? Speak your mother effing mind. Seriously, though, here's the thing about YouTube. This is this is the truth about YouTube. It's this is the thing that a lot of people don't want to admit. YouTube is about clickbait. It just is, and that is how the game is played. Don't hate the player, hate the game. Okay. Tomorrow, if I make a video and it says, um, well, I've said this before. If I title it Sweet Sounds of the Sea, it might get 5,000 views. It just, and then so many of you are going to go, well, I never saw the video. I never got a notification. It never shows up in recommended videos. It's going to be Sweet Sounds of the Sea. But if I post tomorrow, Kathleen Kennedy, or a bold prediction, Kathleen Kennedy will be fired in three months. It'll get 100,000 views because the YouTube algorithm will pick it up. Or if I post something about Captain Marvel, or if I post something about NPCs, or if I post something like that, it will fly. It'll get tons of views. That is just how it is. And all these little soy boys out there that want to whine about clickbait. Motherfucker, you're on the internet. You have a YouTube channel because you want people to click on it, don't you? Okay, then stop whining about clickbait, okay? There's three rules to YouTube. Three. Now, I'm not the expert. I'm not PewDiePie. I'm just a guy that's gotten a little bit of traction recently, and a lot of sweethearts out there are upset about it. It's real simple. Three elements to YouTube. Clickbait title, clickbait thumbnail, but then once you get people to click on those two elements, the content has to keep them there. So if you're a rookie YouTuber, your content still has to back up the clickbait bullshit that you're putting out there. So if you make a clickbait title that's not what you're talking about, and if you do a, sh a, a clickbait thumbnail that gets them to click on it, once they click on it, you got to keep them there. So keep your video between five and eight minutes long. Hit them right when the video clicks. Don't waste time. Don't go, hi, guys. Um, hi, um, this is Jeremy. Um, yeah, I think I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just going to talk about uh, the, um, Captain, um, the Marvel Captain, the Captain Marvel trail. No, you go, what's up geeks and gamers. It's Jeremy coming to you with another video. And today we're going to talk about the Captain Marvel trailer. What the hell are you doing? The MCU, are they going woke? Are they going broke? What is going on with Brie Larson? Let's get right into it. You got to get them right when they click. So there's three elements, clickbait title, clickbait thumbnail, and then right when they click on it, they're only going to give you 20 or 30 seconds if they don't know you. So you got to get them as soon as they click on it. You can't be just blah, 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 blah. Grab them by the balls, okay? That's how you do it. Before I surpass Geeks and Gamers, we should do a stream together. Yeah, you got to let, you you let me know when you're about to pass this, man. You better pass this. Like I said, that's the thing about me on the YouTube channel is like, a lot of YouTubers, like they all are like, they're, they're so jealous of other channels and they're so intimidated by other channels. I'm like, I don't care. Like, I hope if you get more subs than me, that means you're doing a good job of entertaining your audience and you're manipulating the YouTube algorithm. That's really what it comes down to. It's all about the YouTube algorithm and if you know how to play the game. It's that simple. You know what I mean? Um, I I played that conservative by the book YouTube game for three years. I let my team run this channel. Uh, I, we did it by the book. And you know what? It got us 800 subscribers in three years. Then I decided I'm going to play the game that YouTube has set the rules. And you see, we've done well. And so other people know how to play the game better than me. And that's fine. And more power to them. You know what I mean? I just don't, I don't get this intimidation from other channels, you know, like, oh, they're getting more views than me. They're getting more views than me and they're getting more subs. We'll do a better job. Use it as motivation. Like it's not a big deal. Everybody needs a safe space these days. I don't understand that. Why does everybody need a safe space? Why are people intimidated by competition? God damn, play some sports growing up. Put some hair on your ass. Come on. God, put the latte down, you know, Jesus.